<laughs> ah, welcome back to a Let's Talk again. I guess uh, this is the end of my semester and I really don't have time. Oh my god. I did a last Let's Talk like a month ago and I still have so much to say and so much that changed. So, let's get into it. I mean, this is probably not edited or cut or anything, so all the weird parts are gonna be in, um, I guess. <laughs> I'm still not used to doing this, but it's fun to do. I like it, and there's so much, so, so much. So grab a snack, drug my... <laughs> oh God, my mouth is not following what I'm trying to say. Grab a snack, grab a drink, and you could just put this in the background, honestly, it's gonna be nice. Um, if you wanna know about my life, let's just talk about it. Baby Marco, he's been needing of love and attention so bad the last week, it's crazy. Um, if you didn't know, my boyfriend started working a month ago and last time I checked in, I had no job. I just quit where I was working before and I was looking for a new one. So what ended up happening, um, not even like a week, a week, two weeks, a week and a half later about, I got, I sent, applications for like so many places and I got called back from another retail shop um did I I pretty sure I mentioned that I was working at H&M before but if I didn't then that's where I was working and now I'm working somewhere else kind of in the same field kind of in the same thing so it's not super different I don't need to learn anything new kind of I mean different places so different rules and stuff but overall the same kind of job but in a much better environment and I'm so happy about that so I got a job I've worked one week there and so far I love it so much it's very nice I'm very happy with it um I'm paid a little bit more than I was before, but not too much. That it makes a difference. Um, yeah, that's that on that. Aside from this, the only reason why, no only. I mean, it's not very only, but one of the main reasons why I'm doing a less talk this week is because I do have like all the footage of when I put up my Christmas tree, but I don't have the time to edit the whole video and I really, don't want to like mess it up or like do it like edit it and then regret it later of not doing it the right way so what i'm doing is i'm gonna post it probably next week of like me putting up the christmas tree and everything and uh, i wanted to put it up this week but yeah i don't have the time for it so this is why it's the last talk and i kind of needed to give you all the updates I do not plan on doing Glad's Talks every month because I think that would be just a little bit, a little bit too overwhelming or just too repetitive. But I felt like it was the right time just after posting two apartment hunting in a row. Um, this is also an update on that. So no apartments, so um, very much still looking for one. And the only thing that I really have to say is that they're all shit. <laughs> there's there's not a lot of good apartments in Montreal. I don't think my standards are very high, honestly. It's just that either the rent is too high for what I can afford, but it has everything I need, or it just looks bad. It's either the apartment itself or the hallways or the building that looks very, very bad. That's sketchy. The area is weird or it's just like I mentioned at the end of the last, last week's video, the person is sketchy. So I kind of put a pause on that for 
this week just because it's also the last week of my semester it's like very very intense i have like multiple projects due like <laughs> at the same time as this is posted so if you're watching at 5 p.m on monday i'm i have like f multiple assignments due for 6 p.m so um i'm very very much like trying to concentrate on this i was supposed to work today it's sunday and i ended up trying to i i ended up um not working so i can like very concentrate on what i'm doing and the big big project i have to do right now that's like due at 6 p.m i have a short film to do i have nothing almost nothing film and almost and nothing edited and all the paperwork that's uh, that needs to get done with it is done but like it takes so much time to do film and edit and there was so many complications with uh, the teamwork and the project itself that I wasn't able to film earlier and edit earlier so that I could be done or like not 24 hours in advance so I'm kind of cramming everything in the last 24 hours before I need to like hand in the project and on like next week I have my last big exam of the semester but after all of that is done and everything is settled I'm gonna be able to like very much focus on doing apartment hunting again and try to find an apartment as soon as possible and then the moving vlogs are gonna come i know i keep hinting at moving vlogs and actually not doing them but i really i don't want the same situation that i have with this place happen again um there is so much trouble and decisions that need to be made this month and the last two weeks my brain kind of is fucked <laughs> i was very happy the last two weeks i had apartment hunting that i could post as content because i love doing apartment hunting but also because it's a lot less stressful to have to post and edit apartment hunting it leaves a lot of place in my mind to um live honestly and just like take other decisions I had like a big, big decision that I needed to make about this apartment and I, I, I took a decision and I think I'm happy with the decision I made, but could have, could it have been better? Yes, but I don't think I'd be as satisfied as I did, as I do doing this. So I'm pretty sure. It's like the fourth time I'm saying this, but if you haven't watched the videos in which I mentioned it, once I'm out of here, I want to do like a whole documentary, documentary, whoa, not documentary, but like a whole like walkthrough with pictures and evidence of everything wrong with where I am right now. And I'm still debating whether or not I want to give the address away of where this building is. Um, I mean, if you piece things together for the last year, you can probably pinpoint almost where it is. And I'm not very scared of saying this just because I know that in a month I'm not here. And yeah, I mean, I, I, I need to think about it, but I might say where it is just so that you, if you're moving to Montreal, if you see the address, you don't go here. Cause I've been looking on my phone at apartments and it's like, it was so funny. Cause every day you have like the option to like filter from newest, newest listing from older to oldest listing. And out of like 15 new listings, three of them were for my building with different pictures. Like every time I see it, the pictures look so nice. The description is so good. It looks so safe. It's such a shit show though. It's not a good thing, like at all. No. <laughs> so that's that. And is there anything else? I mean, I had a big incident with my cat like two days ago. 
when I was very, very mad about it. And I've kind of calmed down, but I'm always so happy. <laughs> Uh, but yeah is there anything else i don't know if there's anything else that i want to say but yeah it's just like i have such a like busy like week that i don't really have much more time to film and much more time to edit for my videos but i wish i could have the i, I hmm, how do i put this I don't want to sound petty, that's the problem. Because obviously I could sleep less and like hustle more and like take less time for myself and my mental health and just like very much like put in thoughts and efforts into like doing all the editing and everything. But I, at the end of the day, my men, like I come first and I don't think it's selfish to say that. And yeah. I just think it makes my, my the moment right now easier for me to just do a let's talk and then do editing later. But sneak peek. I'm so happy with it though. It was like one big wish um, for this year. I was like, I don't know why. Usually I'm super, super, super excited for Halloween. And for some odd reason this year I was like, nah, not very into Halloween. I really want Christmas. Um... So yeah, like uh, the moment it turned November, I was like, I want a Christmas tree. I want to decorate it. So I got the Christmas tree, finally. And I'm very happy with the one I got. So that's going to be up next week. And then pretty sure I'm going to kickstart like everything else. And then Christmas going to come very soon. And yeah, if this looks so bad on camera, it looks worse than it is. It's just acne, but I've had like so much anxiety the last like two weeks that my acne is very, very bad and it's getting better. I mean, it's just scars, but oh my God. I took a video three days ago at its peak worse. Oh my God. I look like a 12 year old teenager in the middle of like puberty with like the pimples everywhere. I've never had it that bad, and I don't know why, but yeah, it's scarring so much right now. But I don't want to put like foundation or anything on it just so that it heals properly, and I don't like fuck it up more. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm gonna leave this on that. Did that make sense? I'm gonna leave this on that. I'm just gonna end it here, and I hope you have a good week. Um. Good luck with your end of the semester if you're into like the semester or yeah. Have a happy holiday and I'll see you next week with this. I'm I was debating whether or not I was gonna film it with this tree because it's like giving away how cute it is, but I'm still gonna post the how I do it. It's so cool. Okay.